Hello everyone this is Ultimate Public Entertainment. Who is in the wrong here? The choice hotel supervisor or the customer? Recording because I will be showing this to corporate. I tell Nope, nope. I'm not responsible for a pet fee that was not presented to me. And these both these ladies just walked off on me and closed the door as if I'm not even talking. How rude. They are literally inside this door just listening to me talk as if I'm not a customer, did not just pay my money to sleep in this hotel. People was up in here partying till two, three o'clock in the morning. The beds make you itch and all of that. But y'all got the nerve to tell me, oh, well, we gave you a $50 refund because whoever was working the third shift did not charge me for a pet fee that I was not aware of. That's not my issue. And all of this will be used as evidence for when I file my lawsuit. Y'all think it's a joke. This is ridiculous. All I'm asking for is to talk. I'm not being disrespectful, did, and, I do and, I, and I don't like the fact that you're not being empathetic at all. Okay. You just said, oh, well, we gave you a $50 um, discount. Take that up with your employee. He did not charge me a pet fee, and he was aware that I had dogs. Very carefully today, and be very careful on your journey. Oh, absolutely, I will. But Thank still, no, much. no, 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 no. Can I have the number to corporate, please? May I please have contact information to your corporate office? This is really, 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 really unprofessional right now. When I'm sitting here trying to talk calmly as a civilian and as a, a mature adult in regards to a refund on a room that I did not comfortably stay in after I just traveled from state to state to state. This supervisor is not being empathetic or generous or anything and I'm aware of how things go in this type of professional setting. At least it's supposed to be a professional setting. But like I said, I'm not being loud, I'm not being belligerent, I'm not using profanity, and I'm still being treated as if I'm just, hey, I have nothing for you. You didn't charge me a pet fee. That's not my problem. You need to have repercussions for the employee that did not charge me a pet fee. You can't Is there say- anything else I can do for you? Yes, please, I've been asking for corporate number. Okay, just call Choice Hotels. Then. Can I please have that number? You would have to look it up. So you don't have any contact information on your corporate. You, Sheila, you know that's not the way to do it. You don't want to lose your job over this. Please right, don't. Thank you very much. So you really need to lose your job for not giving me corporate okay. number. Wow, that is just crazy. Simply asking for corporate's number. And they won't even give it to me. This is crazy. This is really ridiculous. This woman, no, goodness well, she can give me corporate number. Can you please give me your supervisor's number? Right, please don't do this. Okay. Can you please just give me the number? I did give you No, the you did not. You okay. told me to look it up. I didn't. Please, give I me the number. I the, the, the receptionist, when I asked her for your information, the supervisor, she wrote everything down, printed stuff off. That was very nice of her. Okay. That's how I was able to contact you and find out who you was because she gave me your information. You, but she told me you wasn't here over the weekend, so I had to wait. Okay. okay? And I, I'm really not appreciating the way I'm being treated right I'm now. I'm not treating It's you too much going right on now. in the... You are. You, you're refusing to give me corporate's number, I'm and you're refusing to give me a refund number. on a room that I'm I did not, not comfortably to... sleep in. If, and, if, and if we... Honey, I'm please, not gonna, oh, I, I am not uneducated. Not you don't got to argue. I will have the health inspector in here. Please, don't do this. All right, I appreciate it. All you got to do is just give me corporate's Mr. number. Daniel, too, have a Can you please give me corporate's number? Yes, ma'am, I gave you that. You no, you did not. You did not. You told me to look it up. That number Can you please give me your guys? You guys have, I know how stuff is at work. Y'all got all type of hotline numbers and everything. Can I have a number to corporate, please? If you contact choice, then mm -hmm. you have that, okay? No, I'm asking you to please just give me your, 
supervisor's information. And this is being recorded and you're seriously acting like this. Like you're really ready to lose your job you of the, because the way you treat it. I can. No, that's not true. No, that is, no, oh, man. oh, honey, please. This is for my protection. Because if y'all get to calling the police and saying that I was doing this, this, and this, this is for my protection. Okay, Sheila? Okay. So don't try to say I can't record right. because you I have every right day. to. Thank you. You We're got a booger here. in your nose. Okay, good. I'm not leaving until I get corporate number. Okay, then. You sit there. I will. Okay. Hey. Call 911, please. Call 911 and get them here. Because, like I said, I'm presenting myself in a... Detroit, 911 can't do nothing. I'm yes, right. they will. No, they will not. Nicole, please get the phone. I just I, did this. Uh, I'll call, call them. Call the police. Yes, okay. Thank you. I'll call. When I, when I went through this at the gas station, the lady refused to give me their corporate number. The police came and got it for me. All I'm asking is for corporate's number, and she told me to look it up. She said, oh, well, he gave you a $50 discount because he didn't charge you for the pet fees. But as I stated before, I am not responsible for a fee that your employee did not charge. Y'all need to be writing him up or reprimanding him. Not me. Talking about some, he gave you a $50 discount. No, he didn't do his job. That's what he didn't do. Because at the end of the day, even if he would have charged me for the pet fee and I've asked for a refund, oh, that would have been included in the refund too. So what's the difference? Please tell me the difference. Since you do not want to conduct yourself as a professional being, I'm gonna have law enforcement involved. Yeah, right, I am. Right. Just letting you know. All right, by looking it up online, there's your telephone number. Do enjoy your. I want to know the number that you guys have, that not online. There. No, it is not. Okay, then I can't help you any farther. You can take it down since so you don't want to give me no information. I'll get information on my own. I would go. I wouldn't have to do, you wouldn't have to, I don't got to do anything. All right, so I will you go ain't ahead and call the police. Call the police. I have them on the way right now. That's it's good. fine. That's perfect. That's perfectly fine. And you will be losing your job. That's good. And, and Laura's smart. She got up out of the way because she knows. It's fine, ma'am. Go and do what you got to do. I am. That's great. She won't give me my refund. She won't even give me a, a number to corporate. Right there is the number. She went, I want the number they have. Don't give me no number you got off Google. I sat on the phone for 15 minutes with that number and they did not answer. Wow. That was a lot of drama. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section. HOA Karen fussing over trash disposal. Take a look. I'm sorry? What are you trying to say? I can't throw away the trash? You can't throw away your trash in our bins. Yes, I can. No, you can't. Yes, I can. Could you please leave me alone or I'll call the police? Call the Thank police. Thank you very much. It's 911. Okay, I will. Okay. Call. Throwing away the trash. You know, you're going to be instantly famous. Hi. You're going to be instantly famous. You know that, young lady? Come on. Here, let me close the door for you. See how much a gentleman I'm being for you? Florida. Okay. You're excused. What's Thank your you. name and what are you doing? Please. Here? You're excused, ma'am. I will call the police call the if you police. don't leave. Okay? Call the Thank police. Thank you. What is your name? Martha. Show me your name? license. Do you live here? Show me your license. Show me yours. Show me yours and I'll show no. you mine. Wow. This is Florida, folks. Yeah. Here we go, Martha. We have to pay Zero extra each. for people to come clean okay. out. And we pay extra too. All right. Why do you think I why do you don't think I live here? Because, because of the way I look? Because why? I, until two weeks ago I was president of the homeowners association. Okay. And to my knowledge I know everybody who lives here. Okay. That's the only thing. So why did you assume that I don't live here because you don't know me? Because there's only 40 
42 buildings. Only 42 buildings. You knew every single person in 42 buildings? Where do you live? Huh? Do you know every single person in 42 buildings, ma'am? Thank you very much. I rest my case. Do me a favor. Enjoy the rest of your day. Stop with the fake laugh and just go. All right? It's not a fake laugh. I think it's Enjoy really your day. Funny. I mean, we have this happen all the time. Right. You're not alone. I feel sorry for you. Oh, Don't worry about it. Oh, you got a dash. Have a good day. Here in Florida. Look at that. Oh, my gosh. Look, she's chasing me. Look at her. She's trying to get in the way. She won't even let me go. My gosh. She's taking pictures. There's no tag on the front. Please. Out the way. I will. Come on. And I'm giving you 10 seconds to make your decision or I'm going to call the police and I'm going to go full thing. So I ask you, please, right I'm asking you to listen to your friend because she's making the right decision, ma'am. I don't want any problems. I was throwing away my trash and I'm going on about my day. She turned around. I have it all on video. She turned around and said, where do you live? And blocked me until I wanted to produce ID. This is America. I don't need to prove that I live here to you. Who are you? Just because she doesn't recognize me doesn't mean that I don't belong here, man. This is ridiculous. Thank you. I, I gotta say, if, if that's your only reason for you didn't recognize him, that's not a good reason. Thank you. People come in here all the time. She's obstructing the highway. I know, I saw. Okay. Thank you. Can you please tell your friend to get out of the way, man? Because I really have to go. I think you're wrong. I'm begging you, Judge. What do you want me to do? I, got to, uh, I just like to see where he lives because he doesn't live here. We're both on the board. I understand. Okay, so but that's why she called me. And, oh, good. Um, we can talk about this at a board meeting, but yeah. right now I think you're wrong. Correct. We oh. will come. We will come to a board meeting. You know what, ma'am? Oh, that'd be right. And guess what? Guess what? And now, here, here's the thing. I appreciate you, ma'am, coming outside talking about that because just because she doesn't know me doesn't mean she gets obstruction. She's not the police. So if you were the one in this situation, would you have called the cops? Let me know in the comment section. Drama at the gas station. Take a look at this. For no Dude, reason. What, do you want me to do? what pump do you want me to go to? This is crazy. How do you want me to get gas? Dude, I'm out of gas. What do you want me to do? What pump would you like me to go to? Dude, what pump am I going to? This is insane. Yo, buddy, what pump am I going to? Can you tell me where to go, please? Can you please tell me where to pull up? I don't know where you want me to go. Dude, where do you want me to go? He's not having it. No one is helping me. This is insane. I need gas, dude. Yo, buddy, can I get some 
He need to back up because you're too close to him. Wow. The attendant should be commended for a great job. Entitled Karen was spotted at Soma in California. You're being very rude and disrespectful to my coworkers, so. These people here in Soma think that they're better than everybody else. And they would like to not sell $70 bras to people. When I tell them that my size, they want to argue with me about it. And now they're telling me to leave the store. Because you call everybody disrespectful TV. names. Oh, God. Are we so old? Are we so old? You're an old woman. Bro, I have your bras here, ma'am. Oh, no. I have it here. Sorry for that. Here, you keep recording just in case she says anything. Okay, I have all your bras here. And let me go ahead and cancel that, that order. One, that one. Hey. Get that one. So, what I'm going to do you is I'm going to cancel. They're your girls now? You own them? What is wrong with her? I'm not even clocked in. Yeah, just, you know, it's true for the. Yeah, I want to file a complaint right now. Hold on, my face. No, I want to file a complaint. She just slammed my phone out of my hand. Fine, I will. Let's go. Bye. No, I'm not leaving. Bye. Call the police here. Well, then you gotta call. Okay, I will. Okay. Well, then step outside. I'm gonna go grab her umbrella. Okay. Okay. I'm just saying. Tell that girl to stop. There's like three. It's our right to videotape. Okay. Well, then I'm videotaping these frauds. You can do whatever you want. I know. Yeah, I can. Yeah. I'm a full. We're only getting three things, right? Or did you want to get that? Yeah, of course. Because I can cancel your order. Oh, oh, that's the. Okay, that's the order. Okay. I can price it right now. Three times. You both want to keep videoing me. I'm going to keep videoing them. Graceful lace that I didn't get. And that other one slapped that phone out of my hand, and I have it on the board. She touched me. I did not yes. touch her. Okay, I'm gonna cancel this order so your money goes back. So that girl better purchase it. not. She wants to stop here. In fact, let me call my husband who works for the County Sheriff's Department. I'll call him. You can call him. I am. <laughs> Okay, so I'm going to print out that receipt that it was canceled and then we'll purchase these for the brief for nine months. It won't cancel the other two that are shipping. So if I go no, 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 no. Okay. Her hand? Watch this stuff. Oh my goodness. Not the wallet phone case. A city walker Karen was spotted dumping trash on the highway. The city should be coming this month to pick up this trash, right? Uh, yeah, I think so. Yeah. Just take it to them though. Why are you throwing it here? Because there's the city. I work for the city. They're coming this month. Okay, but just take it to the city. Why would I do that when they're coming here? It's not supposed to be out here like that. This is where the city put it at. What do you want me to do? What? We're in the city of Phoenix jurisdiction. Yeah, but why are you guys throwing it here? Gonna come there's here. dumps out there. Well, they put the notes out, so what are you going to do about it? What? No. Do you, have it do, it do you have it with you? Do you have it with you? Do you have it with you? Nah, I'm just a concerned citizen here that's okay. watching you guys trash our place like this. Because you guys are lazy to take it out there to the junks. There's the one that's laying down. Well, I'm not actively destroying the community I live in, so... No, ya sé que no se puede salir de todo. Si me la pierden, pues ahí está el letón. Yo tengo licencia de todo. Salgo en casa y metemos la policía. ¿Eh?
Đây câu Karen was reported to the city and she had to come back to pick up the trash. You want to come back? You want to cheat with the big boys? Now you're the wrong kitty kitty, you're the wrong kitty kitty.